Okay, all right. Thanks a lot for that, Mitesh. Well, let's tell you about a couple of stocks. One is Hindustan Zinc. That's down in trade. And Vedanta, that opened up higher, but that as well has come off the high point of the day. First up, Hindustan Zinc came out with a set of numbers, but uh, they also declared a dividend of close to around 13 rupees. That takes the total year's dividend to around 49 rupees 50 paise. They're paying it out. Vedanta is receiving it. So good news for Vedanta. The bigger news, though, was that Vedanta will sell its international zinc business to Hindustan Zinc for a valuation of $3 billion, which is massive. 80% of that money has to be paid up front. Now, just putting in the numbers, and if you analyze what international zinc business did in the first half of the year, well, still the deal is valued at around 10 times EV per nabita, which is extremely expensive. The other factor is that Hindustan Zinc has close to 11,000 crores of cash in its books, and they're going to be paying 24,000 crores. So from a net cash, they'll go to a net debt company. And finally, it's a related party transaction, so that's why it's viewed negatively. Good for Vedanta, though. They're going to be getting dividend. They're going to be getting $3 billion. And also, they've included a 2% uh, you know, uh, brand expense that will be paid from Hindustan Zinc to Vedanta. So good news uh, for them. CLSA, they have an underperformed rating on Vedanta. They've maintained their target price around 295 rupees. But a couple of brokerages like Investec as well as uh, Nuvoma, well, they have downgraded the stock. That's Hindustan Zinc. And explains why the stock is under some pressure. Okay, well, let's move on. The mid-cap IT space is in focus. Emphasis on our radar. Reema is here to tell us 